you already know you got to go to that dope website, ashkicking.com, for all your best home health and beauty fragrance products. Pound for pound the best all day. You know what it is. Let's go ahead and get this cracking, y'all. and you're watching Dante's Boxing Nation. Their own thing, so. Hey, you know what? Let me, um, real quick, let me jump on this. Shout out to j Dog. He just shot the link out. Um, we got some breaking news. So um, according to Boxing Scene, Jeff Horn agrees to fight Terrence Crawford. He agrees to the terms oh, wow. of Terrence Crawford. It was going to be kind of hard for him to get around that because um, – Crawford was his mandatory. But let me see. Jeff Horn is set. Let me see. Jeff Horn is set for his biggest test yet after the WBO uh, welterweight champion camp agreed to key terms for a fight against Terrence Crawford. An official announcement uh, could come as early as next week for April 21st clash with the unbeaten American Terrence Crawford. Man, man, that's big news. Shout out to uh, my man, to my moderator holding it down in my comment section for um for blasting that out just like that. That's what it is. So hey, what's your thoughts on that, um, Dwayne? Oh man, I think um uh, right now, like I said, man, ain't nobody messing with Terrence Crawford right now, man. Uh and he he's gonna he's gonna beat him. He's gonna beat Crawford. Crawford's gonna beat Horn and uh he's gonna control that belt. Like mm-hmm. like like Bob Aaron always controlled the WBO belt. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true, he huh? That's true. It, man. He, man, he, that's he, crazy you said he that. He controlled that. He controlled that sanctioning body, man. He controlled that. Yeah. So, uh, shout out to him. I think uh, Chess Cuff is going to do it, man. He's going to do it. Yeah. But man. listen, um, and this is crazy, man. This is his first fight at 147. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's not, I, I do not think that's fair, man. Yeah, yeah. That's, I don't. Well, I don't, man. Uh, you, it's, said that it's you, you, don't fair, you don't think it's fair that, that Crawford has to fight Horn or, that, that, or, or what? What are you saying? I don't think it's fair that Crawford gets a title shot once he comes to the weight oh, division. Oh, okay, okay. But you know they do that a lot, though, Dwayne. If, if, if someone they do is already it, a man. champion, they do it. if someone's already a champion at one division, they usually, you know, put him all the way at the top as opposed to making him climb the ladder. I guess that kind of gives them incentive to to leave that yeah. belt, you know, and fight for another belt, you know, I mean, but uh, yeah, yeah, uh, people people definitely do it, but I don't know, Dwayne. I I think it's it's fair when you already, especially a unified champion at 140, you know, it, it, it seemed like you. Yeah, did. that's what I said. I mean, he was the unified champion, so I mean, I get it, mm-hmm. you know. But I don't like it. I don't like it when I see it other ways, though. You know, I I still feel like Terrence Crawford. He he did his part, but. A lot of times I see it other ways. I don't think that's right, especially to, it, it ain't right to the like the number one and number two, number three contenders and number four contenders and stuff like that. I don't think that's right. Yeah, yeah. But he did he he did put in that word. He did unify the title and he paid for that. Like y'all gotta remember, people gotta understand sanctioning fees ain't cheap. <laughs> it had to come out of like it came out of Terrence Crawford po- pocket to unify them title. You hear what I'm saying? Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. That duck ain't cheap, man. Yeah. And, but he and, wanted to break history. Yeah. And um I just wanted to um no. I just wanted to kind of quote um go over what um Horn's trainer Glenn um Rushton what he said. He basically said that um he was satisfied with the um renegotiated purse and said all there um was left to do was sign a contract. He and he said and I quote, as far as we're concerned, it's pretty much a deal. And then he says, um, but no deal's done until it's done. So we just have to cross the, you know, cross the T's and um, dot the I's and actually get this thing locked down. So, yeah, it sounds like, yes, yeah, it's, it's pretty um, close to um, official. And um, it's most likely going to be out that. here. And it's most likely going to be out here in Las Vegas at the T-Mobile Arena. So Wow, Vegas getting a lot of stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, sure. yeah. They get, when I was in Vegas, I ain't seen none of these fights. Now all of a sudden I'm gone. Now all these fights coming up. 